All right, you guys, to start this baby up, we're gonna put the key in, we're gonna turn the ignition on. We're gonna come over to this panel right here. A press start. We're gonna go ahead. Oh, check tire pressure. What, did you I know, see I that? I saw that, yeah. What? I don't know it... if it's actually telling you to or if there's a sensor in there. Wow, I can't believe it says check tire pressure. That's pretty smart. So we're gonna go ahead and hit start. And that's it, you guys, you're ready to go. This gives you kind of a visual indication of your battery. And this uh, obviously is your hour meter, but it also gives you a uh, percentage of your battery. So I think it's just said we're at like 50% or something, which is cool. Right here, you guys, is your PTO. Put that on, and this is your reverse lockout or whatever they call it, the RCM. But you hit that, you guys, and then you'll be able to back up with the blades on. Always look behind you, though. Parking brake on the left, right here. It just has, like, a hydrostatic drive, right? It's just like hydrostatic. That was a nice job, man. That was a nice job, man. It's like Steven it's Spielberg. Like, yeah, it's like landing on an aircraft carrier. It's I'm what the, it's what stuntmen do. Yes, I'm the director know? today. That was a full motion shot right there, you That's guys. That's beautiful. You yeah. had, See everything behind the scenes, you would have been impressed. Thoroughly impressed. Yes, at what happened just going into that shot. What's up, you guys? Welcome to the channel. Today we're talking about a new mower from Cub Cadet. You may know of Cub Cadet in the industry. They've mm -hmm. been around for quite a long time building quality mowers. This video is sponsored. This is the LT42E XT1 Enduro series. What the heck does that all mean, yeah, Eric? <laughs> <laughs> what does that all mean? Basically, this is lithium ion. It's the first uh, tractor style mower that we've seen. Um, lithium, lithium ion. ion. That's in the garden powered. tractor style. Yeah, know. exactly. It looks like this because when we first, I first saw it, so it was like, oh wow, cool. I thought we were gonna get a, a battery powered mower. Like, well, it is. Well, it open it, isn't it? We're just not seeing mo uh, motor there. Yeah, it's crazy, you guys. It uses the same hood as the tractor, as a gas tractor. You can't tell the difference only by the markings or looking under the hood. And like Eric said, you got a three thousand watt hour, fifty six volt battery, you guys. That's gonna give us what. It's going to give you about an hour and a half of run time or about two acres uh, of mow. Uh, the charge is about four hours. It's obviously if you're on zero, it's about four hours to charge. And you're on what? What do you think? How many acres? Like what are you on here? A little over half an acre, three quarters of an acre. Yeah, I'd say definitely a little over three quarters. Like how many times? How were you able to mow I this? I could mow this three times on one charge with this mower. That's good. And possibly was, some more. It wasn't even that. I'm surprised because when you first told me about this, I didn't think you'd be able to mow your yard once. And right. you told me you got almost three times. Yeah. That's good. Yeah, That's it was pretty good, you guys. Uh, power, lithium ion is going to give you that fade free power over the life of it. Uh, twin blade 42 inch deck does have a blowout port on it. You do need to get an adapter for that. But like Eric said, you just don't have to change the oil. You don't have to worry about anything except for greasing a couple fittings here and there and washing it maybe, yeah. wiping it down, um, sharpening the blades. But like you said time and time again, you're like, man, I love this tractor because I don't have to mess with the motor. I just get on there and I go. And it, you even said one of your neighbors stopped you and talked to you about it. What were they saying? Yeah, no, yeah, they stopped and they're like, man, that thing's quiet. And I was like, yeah, you know, they're like, just they couldn't believe that it was electric and that it lasted. You know, they went and started looking at them. It isn't because it looks like a regular gas mower. And that's what I like about it. This is what I'm used to as a garden tractor mower. Yeah, it's like very this. cool. And the turning radius, you guys, is really tight on this thing. So I was able to do it around my trees, no problem. You have to go check them out. You know what I'm saying? You have to really just go uh, and check them out and look at them yourself and just look at the build quality of them. You know, I mean, this is a pretty good tractor. It's all together. It's just simple, right? It's just got no problems with gas. You're not going to have to, you know. Spark plugs yep. or bad gas, especially at the beginning of the year. Or you're halfway mowing and then you run out of gas. You realize you don't have any gas in your gas can. Now you got to go all the way to get, I mean, it's, it's pain in the, I think it's pain in the butt. Yeah. It's a maintenance free, hassle free solution. You guys, is it for everybody? No. I mean, if you've got five acres, I mean, yes, you're going to need gas, right? This is not going to do it for you. But the greatest thing about this too, is the charge time. It does charge in four hours. So let's say, you know, it, you did let the charge run out of it. You're basically going to in 25, uh, get gain 25% in an hour. Maybe that's enough just to finish your yard. Yeah. Yeah, I like it. Yours was quiet. I thought this was actually like, remember those 12 volts of the cigarette lighters? Yeah. But this is there actually... two USB ports. There's yeah. one. Two. 
two USB ports, you guys, so you can charge your phone while you're going. I mean, this is the future that, you know, everybody's going. Um, it's definitely, you, you're not going to deal with gas anymore. I mean, I, I feel like with this technology, the day of having a gas can in your garage is, is critically coming to an end rather fast. What do you think? I definitely think so. I actually was never a believer in the battery power stuff. I've got push mower and stuff like that. I actually moved everything over. My only gas thing that I have right now is an inverter, and that's it, which is going to go away because of a different inverter. Yeah. So I think, like you said, I mean, like you were talking about, cars are going this way. I want to, I could be wrong, but I want to say there's even like a train and stuff like that that's yeah. got like battery. I mean, I just think this, like you said, is going away. There's just less maintenance. Put it this way, you guys. Sit down. Go look in your garage. You have a gas can in there, which you probably do. How old is that gas? If it's more than three months old, chances are it's starting to degrade already. If it's yeah, last season, yeah, put the ethanol on there. Yep. Yeah, if if it's last seasons, it's definitely going to cause problems for your mower. So this thing, all you got to do is plug in and you're mowing. So good stuff. Comment below what you guys think. Let us know. If, are you transformed into the electric line yet or not? Let us know what you guys think. Tools in action. Click like. Adios. Remember. For more exciting tool action, go to toolsinaction.com.